what's up guys so today i'm gonna be naming three things that i think you should get when you buy your first guitar and amp now this is after you buy it and you need you want to expand a little bit more and you're a beginner i'm gonna show you three things so let's get started <laughs> Picks are a great thing to have. Um, you need picks, especially for playing acoustic and electric guitar. You need picks, and I don't recommend using quarters because quarters will mess up your strings. But if that's all you have, then that's all you have. But picks are probably a very essential thing. Of course, you can learn without playing picks, but or playing with picks. But I think picks. Um, are very essential and needed. Coming at number two is a strap. Now, you know, of course, you don't need a strap, especially if you're not doing gigs. You don't really need it, but I recommend a strap. Is there any ball strap you can get? Straps on eBay or at your local guitar store. eBay not ebay amazon amazon is probably cheaper but than your your guitar store but it i feel like your guitar store probably is gonna have more quality but of course you can look anywhere sweetwater guitar center you can get uh good straps now of course i recommend playing while standing up but that's for a different video but even with sitting down, I use straps because sometimes I just, I don't know, I feel like it helps me hold the guitar better. But straps are very essential. They come in all colors, shapes, and sizes, and in all materials. So, yeah, the straps are great. Coming at number one, there's something that you don't really need because, of course, you can learn by ear. But I recommend a tuner. This is a uh, chord tuner. I don't know if you can see that chord tuner. I recommend a, not a chord tuner, but I recommend a tuner. And yeah, oh, the tuner is great. And you don't need it because for the first couple of months of me playing guitar, I learned by ear. But uh, it's great to have. I bought, I bought my first tuner after a couple months of playing, and it's been great ever since. And sometimes, even when I don't have my tuner on me, which usually I do, but sometimes I just, I'm still tuned by ear. It's a great quality, but when I'm playing somewhere where I can't really tune by ear, like great good quality tuner it's great this is about a 35 dollar tuner you can buy a snark tuner they're about 15 20 to 25 or a cheap tuner i have a bunch of varieties of tuners this tuner i did a video on tuners but this tuner can change pitches and it can also change the display if i turn it on this side will be on this side, and it'll change which side is sharp and which side is flat. Well, that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it helped you. And, yeah. Uh, I hope you have a great rest of your day or night or evening. And keep on playing.